Sprodshaw Community College's Higher Learning is brought to you by Sprodshaw Community College at Sprodshaw.com. Garbage collecting isn't the most glamorous job, I'm sure you can imagine. However, it's necessary for each and every community in Metro Vancouver. So today, I test my upper body strength and I become a garbage girl. I know what I put in my garbage. It's not light, those cans, that's for sure. Rumors that they're gonna let me drive the truck. Are these guys crazy? They must be. I'm Richard Charlton. I've worked for the City of North Vancouver in the Utilities Department for 32 years. Uh, the qualities we look for for garbage collectors are A, uh, good driving, and definitely the physical fitness of uh, the swamping uh, and the strength to be able to lift the cans. So these are the handles that we use to, uh, after we dump the garbage in, and it's full? Yeah. Oh, that's a nasty. Ew. <laughs> we had Rami explain uh, how the levers for the uh, packer works. So this one yeah. packs and this one slides, is that yeah, right? Like this. A lot of times people have done it wrong and you've had garbage spill all out on the road. Oh no. Okay, Melody, you ready? I think so. The smell of any kind of garbage makes me want to throw up. That's definitely something you have to be able to handle is the smell and uh, just the whole yuck factor of uh, collecting garbage. You're on this side. <laughs> well, wish me luck. We're gonna let Melanie drive the garbage truck now. We're not sure how that's gonna go. We're going right around the building. Okay. Yeah. I have driven a bus. I got fired from that job. Let Rami hop on the back. <laughs> Do you want a death wish? <laughs> I think Rami felt pretty good uh, with her driving the truck. He was keeping a pretty close eye on her in the mirror and uh, she was keeping a pretty close eye on him. One, keep going, there's two cans there. You see them? Yeah, yeah that's where you want to get, get to. Backing up, she seemed to have a bit of a problem with that, but overall, I think she handled it well. It wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. I thought it'd be harder. Now we're going to move to the next uh, part of the day, which is taking Melanie out into the field and actually uh, doing some garbage swamping. Victor uses two hands and just smacks them up against the truck. I, on the other hand, can only do one. So I start with one. Can you lift that? Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Uh, she's uh, she's doing pretty good, but uh, her pace is a bit slow and she's struggling lifting some of the cans. No one told me I was supposed to run ahead. It's not my fault. If my pacing is off, it's because I wasn't informed otherwise. I broke their garbage can. Wasn't supposed to do that. I couldn't help it, I've been too strong. My hand just went right through the bottom. Oh, these people had fish last night. Nasty. You know what people had for dinner last night. You know if they've got babies in their house. It is nasty out there, people. Ugh, I need to take a shower. All right, Richard, you saw me on the truck. Would you hire me or would you fire me? Uh, Melanie, I think your pace was just far too slow. We'd have to fire you. Oh. Hey, you fire! Melanie's pace uh, definitely suffered a little bit and her uh, physical ability to pick the cans up would be the two main reasons. You're using your entire body, you're getting on and off the truck, and these guys are doing it in every possible kind of weather. Melanie definitely had an upbeat attitude, uh, smile all the time. Is that disinfectant? Yep. Spray away. Okay. Sprodshaw Community College's Higher Learning has been brought to you by Sprodshaw Community College at Sprodshaw.com.